not the easiest of jobs. No, it's much easier to sit here and analyze it on the screen than it is to actually be out there in real time. Kadeem Jack into the game, the former Fort Wayne Matt Ant. With Hammonds in for Reno as well, and he goes all the way to the cup, bounces it off, easy flush for Kadeem Jack. But you wouldn't know that with the way they're playing the night. They definitely want to continue to, winning, to win games heading into the postseason. Eric Moreland lays it in. 11 now for Thompson, who averages 10.9. Good pocket pass, easy flush for Moreland. The look from Cliff Hammond. Green, good on the runner. What a tough shot from Green, who actually had Hammonds wide open under the basket. Steen Reno passing up a layup to kick to the corner for an open three. Somehow Brewer didn't come down with that rebound. Last couple minutes. Well, both of these teams in the top six in the D-League and base, of course, Reno first as Tyndale lays it up and in with a left, and Santa Cruz sixth at 101.82. Dez, and the rebound to Hammonds. Numbers for the Horns. Hammonds, Stockton, lays it in. Well, typically, the Warriors humming on the offensive end. Dukin answers back, drilling a top of the arc triple again. 52% out of Cairo, Georgia. Gets it back out to Duye Dukin for three. That is just beautiful basketball. Alito finding Hammonds. Hammonds they just went out at home and they have the record. Got to go five and two over the final seven. It's a win percentage of 714. Green the fall away. So not thought that shot was going in the moment it left his hand. Stockton and one. Looping the harm.